Gareth Southgate, believe it or not, is a hell of a lot better than me. So I'd like to think that I'm doing my bit for the country, uh, you know, giving them a little bit of confidence before the Euros. We've been working on a AR game which is mapped specifically to Wembley itself. Um, a multiplayer game using the Samsung handsets. When you point it at the Wembley Stadium, then we can see graphics, um, the game itself, which you can play in situ of the uh, stadium. So the cameras in our handset communicate to the cloud and that data uh, is transferred between both of those handsets and also talks to some quite innovative anchors, um, which tell us basically where the real world is and, and where our graphics should live. 5G um, has just given us the, the speed um, and the reliability as well. You know, the moment that the network drops off, the game doesn't work. The power of cloud computing has been yeah. harnessed through the 5G network. We've been here with Gareth Southgate, some ex-England players, and a whole host of talent who have been playing a 5G foosball tournament on the pitch at Wembley. The whole part of, of us partnering with Wembley Stadium is to connect the stadium. So we installed a high-tech network and it's for fan experience. So when you're here, you can still use your phone, you can tweet, you can send pictures, you can FaceTime from your seat. The point is that you're still experiencing your phone as you'd expect to anywhere else. It's just making your phone centric to your experience and then enhancing your, your day out at Wembley. Our 5G network at Wembley has been installed uh, for some time now. We're always looking for a creative way to bring the 5G story to life. 5G brings high bandwidth and low latency, and it's the low latency is the requirement for this game to avoid in-game glitches and buffering. We're always looking at pushing the boundaries of what is physically possible and making people connected whilst they're in the stadium. Literally, you look at the phone when you're first looking at it, it's the grass, and then it's the, the pitch is crazy. I just looked around and I remember that was in Wembley and it took me out of the game for a minute, but it's just incredible how it projected on the actual pitch. You can play it on your phone with your friends, um, like you said, whilst you're actually in the stadium as well. Managers and coaches used to use a tactics ward or um, you know, later on it was you know, video analysis and things like that. But if you could use that, if you picked yourself in actual situations, especially on set pieces and you know, how to mark, how to set up, I mean, it's, it's, it could be a big part of football in, uh, in years to come. If you're a gamer on the phone, you enjoy it.